welcome back to another Star Me tutorial. My name is Benji and we're looking at everything logic gates. Uh, we've had a lot of requests come in for some of the stuff and everyone's pretty excited about this sort of being added into the game. So let's have a look at what blocks we have at our disposal and what we can do with them. Uh, first we have our activation block here and this is a very basic block. It's basically like a lever so you can go up and turn it on or you can turn it off and it will just hold that state whether it's on or off. Next we have our not signal and these are when we start getting into logic gates uh, in electronics so the not signal is basically inverts anything that comes in so if this activation module is on which it currently is because it's blue so blue means it's on uh, and it goes in then it'll be a signal that says that it's off coming out of that. And orange is how we denote something that is off. The next block we have here is called the AND signal or the AND gate. And basically this won't go on until all the inputs going into it are also on. Next we have our OR signal and this block will go on when any of the signals going into it goes on. But if all the inputs going in are off, then this will also go off. Finally, on the end, we have our delay block. And this has a 0.5 second delay that it just adds to any signal going in. And that's going to be useful for creating some timers and stuff. 